Good morning, Danny. It's November 21st, and in this video, we're going to be talking about fast food, social events, friendship, and betrayal, because no video should be complete without betrayal. By the way, if you've never played Betrayal in the House of Haunted Hill game, now I know that's not the name of the game, but I know that it has Betrayal House and Haunted in it somewhere in the title. Then I should bring it up for Christmas and get everyone to play because it is an awesomely fun game. So first, fast food. While I was in Florida doing the NASA social event, it was really hard to find places to eat that weren't fast food. Turns out, I'm not as big of a fan of fast food as I once was when I was younger. When I came home from Florida, I was so excited to eat fresh fruit and vegetables again that that's pretty much been my diet since I got back. For now, we're going to take a break on fast food, but I'm going to return to it later when I get to punishments. But the NASA social event? Wow. That's all I can say about it. I'm so thankful that NASA picked me in order to attend the Maven launch because it exceeded my wildest expectations for what was going to happen there. Not only that, but I met some of the most incredible people that I have ever met before. Hi Zane, Eugene, Meg, Schultze, Matt, and Joe, you guys are the best. Just kidding Patrick, you're cool too even though your phone's from another decade. Hashtag BBM for life. I wish I could explain to you Danny how amazing this event was and the only way that I've been able to describe it to people is that it's like some kind of weird combination of summer camp meets the high of skydiving and it was that combination that just exploded and it was amazing. In other words, it was kind of life changing and I now have a bunch of goals that I want to start tackling right away. I think we can improve our videos a lot, actually. I totally agree with you. But I think that one thing that you and I could do is to start filming just things in our everyday life using our phones. I mean, I still don't really know what you do on a day-to-day -day basis there in Washington. Speaking of our videos, I think because of last week and the whole hospitalization of Kenzie, I think that I'm the only one who has to do a punishment video. However, that was until yesterday when you didn't post a video. And it was definitely your day to post one. Now, guess what? <laughs> yeah, you're gonna have to do a punishment as well. The one I have for you comes courtesy of my roommate, John. He told me this awesome story where he was issued a challenge by his friends stating that he had to eat every item off the Wendy's value menu in under 10 minutes. I think this is a perfect punishment for you because you just told me that you were on a healthy diet and what's the antithesis of a healthy diet? Fast food from Wendy's. And a lot of it at that. You have to film this one. Oh, and not in portrait. Who films in portrait? Kenzie, you are a terrible videographer. It's like it's amateur hour up in here. In terms of my punishment, I'm gonna leave it open to anyone who's watching or you, Danny, and you get to choose. But Hank Green had a really good one where he would have to learn One Direction songs and then busk. Since busking is apparently not a very common word, it means to play music or otherwise perform for voluntary donations in the street or in subways. So if you can top that, let me know because otherwise I've got some learning to do. Danny, I'll be sure to check out that article about C.S. Lewis and math during my Thanksgiving break because that's when I'll have the most time. I think I found the article, but you should definitely post it in the description of your videos. I have an entire week off from school during Thanksgiving, and I think what we should do during Thanksgiving is film our respective Thanksgiving dinners or any events that happen during those days, and then we should put them in our videos after that. And it also means that Thursday, we don't have to do a video because it's Thanksgiving and we're going to be celebrating with lots of food in our face and football in our eyeballs. On that note, I will see you tomorrow, Danny.